be a search and destroy, Mike. Potentially one, the last map. One more map. One more map and mega advance into the grand final. First time ever a New Zealand team will make it to an Australian land event grand final. History could be written in the books. The page is open. The pen is on the paper. Is all they need to do is get this one last map. Swifty is going to have the bomb. It's going to be the faction with their attacking round. Once again, they've only got one map to their name, and it hasn't been in this continuation series since we started back up. Mega have been on fire. If you could blame them being a little bit rusty for having quite a bit, a little oh bit yeah. of a break, they've have played two maps. Yeah, there, no excuses left for that one. They picked off two good kills, so it's a great start there for them. They're going to try and get this bomb down. You see Zeus now, the last one alive. He's going to be going through the side on the catwalk. He's going to get taken nice. down. That's a good okay. round to the faction. I was, I was, I wasn't going to bash on them straight away, but I was going to highlight the fact that uh, they got romped in the first two maps. But that's just. Answer back quite nicely there. Not a single player from the team dropping, and every single one of them getting a kill. Good job there by TF. Uh, it has to be noted, though, on the positive side, in that half point, they were down by 150 points uh, coming into the last four rotations. They did pull it back to less than a 80-point game. So they're not bad players overall. Like, God forbid you'd ever say the word bad players and the, f the faction in the right sentence. But... It's almost like they're getting warmed up and heated when these game modes are coming towards an end, if that makes sense. Yeah, it seems like they might, you know, that composure might be a little bit of, of a thing, but you're also going to keep in mind, Omega have just been constantly in their face. You can't blame them for that because Omega have just been that one step ahead of them throughout the map so far. That being said, they've got plenty of time to change around. It might be 5-1, but it could be 6-5 in a couple of hours' time. Mm -hmm. Eminence, he's still alive. This is a really bad thing. Eminence needs to be dead. After the previous search and destroy, if if he's not dead, uh, TF aren't getting around. That's going to be my prediction. And he was alive and they win the round. So, so far, my theory is correct. Bakabek gets the final kill. Yeah, to be fair, Bakabek did all the work there, so I, I'm not really going to count your oh, prediction either way. I think, you, you, I think you look Eminence's at that presence was enough. You know, just him sitting there in the game, just be like, Bakabek, do your thing. Possibly. Who knows? Either way. We do have the uh, the next round starting on up. Of course, it is now 1-1, one, one, so both teams have won their same side there in that one. But, you know, the faction on their attacking round, can they do it again? That is going to be the big one. He does spot one, cut, you know, once crossing over through yellow there. But Blue will be able to take that. Hydro sees his teammate. I thought he actually panicked on his teammate for a second. And, uh, you know, still a 4v3. Swift, he's still with his bomb. He's still swapping over to these players. Luke is going to be over onto this A side. He's going to get taken out. Killer Pie now over on this flank. He's going to be taking nice. down a one. Nicely done. Still two left. One's going to be going through the flank. He'll get shut down. Blue now swapping over. Of course, seeing these two players, I mean, you see them right Ooh. now back over onto this pool side. Mm -hmm. They're going to be holding, really sticking together as a team. Whereas the team of Mega, you see one. They're, they're relatively close as well. So they're all approaching the same sort of area. It does seem like they just know it's going to be there. And nice. There's one kill. Back of X, last one alive. Eminence's presence is gone, but he's going 4-1 to one himself on that four streak. Let's see if he's going to put it to use. Yeah, hopefully he can get at least a six going here. Checks the bomb. Hasn't gone down. 30 seconds left. Now, he has a 50-50 chance here. Does he stay at A? Does he rotate to B? It looks like he... Yeah, okay. Ooh. This could be huge. He knows where one of them is. There Go it is. Got two! Oh. oh, he's got it! What a play by Bakabek. He played that so well. He saw the player, didn't panic, held the shots, and was like, right, I'll just wait till I find out where the second one is. Bum got down, and he just... Easy two kills. Easy. Do you still think it's the presence? Maybe. I don't know. Okay, maybe not. I think back of X just a god. So far, two search and destroy maps back to back. We have seen three one v two clutches take this place. This is nuts. Like, do they do they practice clutching? Like, do they purposely like? I can I can see them around now coming to each other like and it's being like, yo, back of X, you want to do some clutching? Like, yeah, man. And he just dies, and they just do their thing, you know. Is that I, I don't know. I you don't know. I'm. Know. That's my theory. That's my new one, since though the Eminence one wasn't working out too well. It will be another aggressive round for the team of Mega Bomb Carrier Hydra. I like, look how aggressive one of the players from Mega is. He's actually should be able to draw first blood here. Just trading out shots towards the B bomb site. And it looks like they're going to be trying to make a play towards it. Eminence just going to jump on to the bomb site. Try to get it down as quick as he can. That's going to be a kill. Finally erupting throughout the map there. Killer Pie takes out Hydra. And now they're going to try and make some play. TF need to fall onto this bomb site. They're getting the picks, and that's actually perfect. Leaving Zeus 
if Zeus is yet to get a kill in two search and destroys, please, for the love of God, get what? Really? He got 50 points. So he got an assist. So in two whole S and Ds, went nearly, nearly halfway into this one, and Zeus has yet to get a single kill. Really? And it's fine. You're speechless. Like you're just, you don't know what to say. Like yeah, no, he's lucky shots. Not really. Next round. I mean, we, we really got to focus on the next round. <laughs> poor, here. We, poor Mike. We, I, we, we can't I, touch anything. I put we, him we on have, the coals. We have, I'm we have sorry, nothing, Mike. We have nothing left to touch up on on, on those last rounds. I mean, the, the gameplay really spoke for itself. Mm -hmm. So focusing on this next round, we got Zeus picking off the kill. He's oh, able he to uh, to take Thank down one God. with the sniper there. Second shot from Blue wasn't so lucky as the first, and he's going to be still chasing these kills to be able to take that one, making it a three v three situation. We do have them now making it three v two with Mega taking it down at Killer Pie, of course. That was back a back. Who was able to pick up that kill right now? They're with Blue and Swifty. They're they're really rethinking their life choices right now <laughs> and where they're going to be going with this bomb. Yeah, they're trying to pull a few lifelines. Phone home or something. They just don't know what to do. Luke Michael is a just try and work something out there. Blue. Ooh, he could have got a nice little quick scope there, but back a back too quick. Luke Swifty one v three has to try and rotate around. Does spot one player. Exos are back towards him. Good use of it there, but his location has been given. The mega players know exactly where he is. Drops down. He just had to go for it there. You can't blame him too badly. And that's Mega getting a good round to answer back. So it just seems like defensive rounds and offensive rounds are just going to get traded throughout this one. Zeus, though, first time this round that he's got kills in a long, long time. You can't remember, can you? I was trying to do that. It's been so many rounds. That's a problem. Either Sorry, way. Zeus. I mean, he's, he's got them now and they've got Is the Is that what now? Mega need right now to just, you know, go two steps further and actually win this? Him getting kills. Yeah, we'll yes or no? Just say yes or no. Don't don't avoid the question. Yes. Yes. Okay. Finally, Mike didn't avoid a question, guys. We can tick that one off the checklist. Ran out Swifty on board. Ooh, Kobe nade. Ah, oh, I was <laughs> I was expecting it just to land in front of Eminent and just explode in like a Michael Bay film, but my hopes were shattered. Anyways, Mega, right on top of this bomb site, Mike. I really love this. Mega, especially Eminence, just doesn't joke around about trying to get that bomb down. He doesn't. I mean, he, he tried to do it, but he did get shut down. So that bomb is going to be down there over onto that B bomb site, stopping over between these players. We do have a player playing extremely far forward there in that one. He actually did get taken down. So that is going to now be a 1v4 situation. Zeus, he's gotten two kills now in the last two rounds. Let's see if he can keep that going. Gets oh. tags there on Killer Boy. Luca's got a contest. He takes nice. down Luca. He's got three more players all spread out across the map. Let's see which one he's going to find first. He does spot Killer Boy and he Do might it. be looking to finish the deal here. Seeing whereabouts he's going to be. But of course, there's he's only 15 go. seconds remaining. So he needs to make this <sighs> play in you know, Blake, this play count. Unfortunately, we're I'm annoyed he got that hit marker. That would have been insane if he got the kill because that would have just made. Uh, it, Mike, you've been in situations. We've both played COD to an extent of which we are classified as nerds. When you're in like a 4v1, like there's one player left, and two of your teammates just drop like that and it becomes a 2v1, you don't know really what could happen. And we're just going to have to end it there. We'll quickly write that down. So it's 3 3 in score count. Just, uh, <laughs> I can see from here, Killer Pie's Xbox is just like, nope, 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 nope. You're yeah. not playing no more. So, back to what I was saying. If you're in, like, a situation where it's 4v1 and two of your teammates just die instantly, the pressure that gets put on you as the final two players, it's like, the thing you're like, oh, crap, do not let, do not get clutched, you know? And that's almost like the psychological level of what goes on. He could have very easily, if he hadn't got that hit marker, Clutch that out. I'm willing to say it because it just would have made TF panic. You asked me if I've ever been in that situation with, you know, knowing about that situation. I can safely say I've never been in that situation. I'm always the one that gets really? killed first. Ah, poor Mike. Yeah. E either I mean, way. We played a few um, online comps together. Yeah, with, yeah. Uh, the what fellow casters, Luck Dog, and a few others. O overall, though, you know, we, we did have a couple of technical issues, right, with Killer Pie. Mm -hmm. So it seems like his his game didn't want him to keep on playing. No. Either way, um, I think it's uh, I think a short breaks in order to get that sorted. Yeah, I, I agree with Mike here, guys. You should quickly just go to Lou, grab some food, grab some drink. We're going to be back, sort out all the issues. It is a three three score count. So write that down. We'll be back shortly with more Solar Search and Destroy. <laughs>
And as quick as the issue arises, it is erased. Back into we go. It says 0-0, zero, zero, but the actual round count is three apiece. So if we end it early, do not freak out too badly. It's going to be TF on the aggressive side. Killer Pie's back in the game. No error message. Good start to the round. It definitely is. I mean, not 100% sure what happened there, but it's glad that it's it's glad and reassuring that everything has been resolved here in, in this match, and this match can continue. But, you know, maybe that short break, maybe that short break has cleared TF's head. Maybe they maybe. can uh, use that break and form some momentum. They just loosened up, you know, did some yoga. Just, you know, let the blood flow go. Sounds really creepy. Uh, anyways, bit. I don't know. They, they really have to try and work with something here. And having two players already dead is not the ideal start there. They do answer back, though. Killify actually takes out one. And they both drop at the same time. That's going to be... Four to three in favour of Mega. Two rounds away from the being the first New Zealand team to ever qualify for the grand final at an Australian land event. It's pretty important stuff. It's a once again it's, it's history in the making. It's already been history in the making. Yeah. I mean, we've had some we've had some huge you know fourth and fifth placings there out of these out of these guys. But it's biblical level stuff. It you is. had Noah Noah's Ark. You had Moses parting the river, and then you had Mega making it to the grand final. I guess you could compare the, the, all those uh, in one. I mean, I wouldn't. But I think it's pretty big. I don't know about you, Mark. I, I, I think that really says it all because, as you said that, the kill feed lit up. So, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think they were partying. Yeah, but for TF are religious and they're like, no, Curry, you can't say that. Not going to happen, mate. I was just talking to a few of the players prior, uh, just during that quick little break. They're putting their money on Mega. They just they believe Mega are going to be able to get this one. As he's just giving me the reassuring look of, okay, yes, Curry, stop looking at me. Uh, but look, Eminence is still alive. He's got three kills. Zeus is still alive. He's got three kills. I think they're going to get this one. The bomb has been planted, so now all they need to do is just hold back, sit back, or relax, and don't die. And pick off a couple of kills and a defuse. Like, oh, kills hell. But, like, not die. Like, it's all about the KD, bro. You uh, feel me? That was horrible. Never do that again. Oh. Anyway, we are born with the blue. He's still somehow alive after taking a guilt ton of bullets there into his chest. He's just going to be rotating Sorry, wait, around. What still mission mission situation. Do do? We'll just hold, hold it over back. You will be able to take down one. Swifty is also being taken down. So it's a 1v1 situation. He sees him. He knows exactly where he's going to be. Play's going to be waiting for him. Goes for the shots. And he will be does able he, to take him got, down nicely. Done. Can he go for a red? No. no, he will. Okay. For More importantly, shots. what was that measurement you used? What? When Gilletons? Shot him with the what? Gilletons? Gilletons. Is I made that it up. Can someone break out a dictionary and check if that's real? Like, can you tweet me that? The, the at is at Markster94. That's Marks. Mine's at Dr. Curry. I want to know if that's an actual measurement. More importantly... you have an underscore? Oh, I do too. Somewhere in there. Just chuck in an underscore anyway. I'm sorry I've shot myself out. One more round, and Mega will qualify for the grand final. They're going to be on the defensive side here. This is their base. It's on a platter right now. All they have to do is pick when they take it. Right now, these guys, Hydra, taking down one off early. So it's a great thing for them. Let's jump on board with them because this could be a historic moment right now between these two. They're leading. Remember, for those just tuning in, five to three right now as there's oh, only sorry. two players left up from the team of Faction it's right now. It's they did team. spot one. Hydra is going to be seeing. He misses the shot, though. That's and his rare. teammates will be looking to possibly try and get these shots here. Back of X is going to be contesting. Back of X is going to get shut down. And Hydra will be looking through the main pool. He's going to try oh, and get a couple shots there. He's going to get taken down as well. Eminence takes down one. It's a 1v1 situation. Up against Blue. We saw this just for a moment. Earlier, before in the previous round, let's see if they can make it happen. Will Eminence is clutch? Will Blue? They're about to run into each other. Oh. Who won that? The, the player left standing, oh. obviously. Oh, thank God. I thought I thought for a second there, Eminence got another clutch. Well, like, it, the problem is, if he clutches this many times, his head is going to get so inflated, he won't be able to fly back to New Zealand, and us Australians will have to deal with him for more months. So thank you, TF, for winning the round. I said that really angrily towards you. Them. You really did. You see, it seems really like you did. have a little bit I of a vendetta in that. against them. Either way, you gave him the left, right, good night. Maybe this could be the start for th two more straight Hopefully. rounds. I'd love them. to see more. Who doesn't want to see more maps? This Who is doesn't? incredible. Who doesn't? Who doesn't indeed? But it's now going to be them on the attack once again. One round from going into the grand final. Back and back opens up with a nice double kill. He'll get shut down in return, but it's now a 3v2 situation. One more will drop. So Blue's going to be the last one live. He gets spotted. He's going to be over into purple. Did seem like he got tags though from the other person's screen, but I mean, 1v3 situation, let's see what he can do. He's trying to rotate around, he knows where the players are, he did just get spotted there. Eminence has already put a few bullets into him though, but he's managed to recover, he's going to spot one of them. That is it! 
Mega advanced to the grand final, the first New Zealand team in history of the ANZ COD to make it to a grand final in Australia. Incredible stuff. They take out the faction. Mike, I'm willing to say this is a pretty big upset. The faction, easily one of the teams people would have predicted to make it to the grand final. Such a strong team online. And the New Zealanders, flown in during the week, yep. have just made upsets throughout the day and they're going to be up against x5 in the grand final you got to admit x5 and the faction was it was that favorited grand final mega were up there but a lot of people you know third maybe fourth depending on how they play on the day they've come out they've been on points oh yeah and, and right now i mean they they took that one out Oof. That, nobody can question that that they're definitely skilled using their lineup for the first time at a land mm -hmm. event of course having just recently changed off the apac picking up eminence in replace of killer pie yep. so i mean that lineup seems to be working they seems to be going great that we had so many clutches oh. in those search and destroy so many 1v2s we can make not a just one player but multiple players yeah and, i mean that's our loser bracket final tonight. we're down to two we're down to two xl5 t1 and the one and only mega gaming yeah. Guys, the grand final will be up really shortly. Make sure you share the stream. Make sure you let everyone know what is going on right now. The grand final, the first, uh, first ever does play land, is about to be underway. We're going to go to a break. We'll be back very, very shortly.